because what they said is we're taking all public subsidy away and we're going to actually put that burden on the students. Unfortunately, students in our university are the ones not likely to get the £35,000 a year jobs. They are the students who are more likely to default on that debt. They want to reduce that debt from the government's perspective, not from the students' perspective. And the way they can do that is to say, right, we will have all of the subsidy goes, we will then have cheap fees, but what they mean by cheap fees is a cheap education where you actually get rid of research, you put lecturers on teaching only contracts, you casualise the staff, you have extra large classes, you narrow down the curriculum. Is this starting to sound familiar? Because that's what they are doing here. And we know it's Unison members' jobs today. We know fine well it's our members' jobs tomorrow. I've got a letter here from Dave Prentice giving his support to the actions being taken by Unison, UCU and BNUS. Young people have had the EMA taken away, tuition fees tripled, cuts to further education, cuts to higher education, the autonomisation of the education system, free schools, it's, it's a class war we're facing. We will fight tooth, nail, I don't care if the police has to physically drag me out of the building and in order to make a point, this is unfair. We have a right to learn. We're going to be lobbying NUS 